UVA School of Medicine scientists has opened the door for potential life-saving new treatments for solid cancer tumors, including breast cancer, lung cancer, and melanoma. Destiny Harris is live in studio with more. Hi, Destiny. Hi, Steve. The protein SAS-1B could lead to a valuable new target on human cancers. The discovery started with Dr. John Hare, who suddenly passed away in 2016. Eight years later, the work he started is continuing and closer to improving cancer care. The reason it's important overall is because a lot of people are still dying of cancer. Um, and, you know, it's a, it's a major killer. Um, it's in the top, the top two compared to heart disease. Dr. Craig Slingluff is a professor of surgery at the University of Virginia. The protein is expressed normally in oocytes, so in the egg cells of the ovary. And it has, John discovered it has a role in the egg fertilized, being fertilized. Um, and therefore, you know, important for reproductive um, function. Slingluff says his discoveries about the SAS-1B protein found in developing eggs of women could pave the way for new cancer immunotherapies. What we've seen so far is expression on breast cancers, pancreatic cancers, lung cancers, kidney cancers, this unusual um, uterine cancer that we initially studied, that he initially studied, um, melanoma. UVA says antibody drug conjugates or CAR T are used to attack cancer cells while also sparing healthy tissue. Some of the CAR T approaches that have been used have targeted things we know are expressed on other normal tissues um, and so, and, and not expressed, you know, on some of the cancers. Um, but hopefully this will play out to be effective. Um, for some of those cancers as a CAR T therapy or as an antibody drug conjugate therapy. Dr. Slingluff says the next step in this is to test it on animal models to see if cancer can be controlled in that setting. Live in the studio, Destiny Harris, 29 News at 6.